What I have here is a match and a match box, and I'm going to light the match. Okay, get that well lit, blow it out, and make sure it's cooled off. Okay, and it should be cool. Fill the top, yeah. So it's pretty cool right now, and. I am going to snap my fingers and hopefully that should be able to make it light again. And the burnt match is able to be lit again. And that's magic. Here's the preparation slash how to make this trick. Um, what you're going to need are two things. Uh, at least two matches and I'll show you why you need at least two matches in a second and a sharpie marker or any black permanent marker um, you're gonna take one match any match and take the cap off the marker and what you're gonna do is color in the red part and you can probably guess why you're doing this this is to make it appear to look burnt when it's not really burnt so colored in pretty well, even past the red part a little, so it looks more burnt. Okay, so once it's all colored in, uh, it should look pretty burnt. You can see that. Uh, yeah. So just make sure all the red is off. So if you show a spectator, they will not suspect anything. All right. Once this is complete. You want to put this off to the side, and you should be all ready to go. Just have a box of matches, and yep, that's how to prepare for this trick. And I'll show you how it's done now. Here's how you perform this trick. You take the match that you had uh, drawn on before with the marker, and you're going to hide this on the back of your finger just like that. So no one can really see this. And it's pretty natural, no one's going to really suspect it, as long as you do this before you show them the trick. So you just have it like that. Alright, so you go up to a spectator to say, hey, you want to see a trick? Um, and at this point, all you have is a box of matches, or you just have a match, it doesn't matter, just one match at this point. So you take a match out, put the matchbook off to the side, take it, light it. blow it out and you show them that it's pretty burnt and when you're lighting this you want to burn it about to the point where you drew on so it looks pretty even you don't want to burn it down to here and then have the actual the fake match only burnt at the top so you blow it out you show them that it's completely burnt you say "Ooh, it's kind of hot it's not really hot it cools down as basically as soon as you put it out so it's kind of hot just blow on it now you want to blow hard and you want to look at your hand or look at the spectator and you're gonna throw it away you're just gonna throw it away you're gonna keep going if you're and you don't want to do this just in case you don't want to do this on a carpet or anything but so if you're on a wood floor or outside or anything if it's gonna make a noise you want to speak loudly so they don't hear it and you don't want to like you don't want to smile or anything you just want to keep going and while you're shaking it with your middle, with your thumb, you kind of pull it up, not like sudden or anything. So you go like this and you stop. And you say, all right. So you can see that it's, it's cooled off now. And you snap your fingers, say a magic word, do whatever you want to do. But at this point, basically, you just have to light it again. This is just a regular match with Sharpie on it. So it will burn again. And you can light it. And. There you go. Lay it all you want, blow it out, eat it, whatever. Don't actually eat it. And that's the trick. So if you have any questions, just comment and I'll be happy to answer. Uh, thanks for watching.